okay, I'm gonna get started. I haven't washed my hair in about two and a half weeks, so it needed a good washing. Uh, I start by pre-pooing my hair. I section with my fingers, and I take my favorite hemp seed oil. Hemp seed oil has a lot of ceramides in it, and I have a whole blog post on ceramides and the benefits. So that's what's in the applicator bottle, and I saturate my hair from root to tip with the, of the hemp seed oil. Okay, now I used to just use the oil alone and then uh, pre-poo overnight. There I'm showing you the shed hair that I'm getting. Um, but now I cut back on the time by applying the oil followed by a water-based conditioner and going under the steamer for about 20 minutes. So first I saturate my hair from root to tip with the ceramide oil, then I go over it with the Dollar General. Uh, version Tresemme Moisture Rich. That's what that bottle is. Moisture Rich Conditioner. It cost me like three dollars for this big behind container. So I saturate my hair then with that um, conditioner. It's very thick and creamy. Any cheap conditioner will do. And I just go through, detangle, distribute the product. Everything is done with my fingers and I remove any shed hair. And then when I'm done, I just twist it up to get it out of the way. I continue that throughout the whole head and then I'm eventually going to just be left with a bunch of twisted sections. Here's the last section in the front. I do the same thing, saturate with the hemp seed oil and then follow that up with the moisture rich conditioner and then twist that section down. Again, I use my fingers for the pre poo step. It's just detangling um, and pre pooing just helps your hair just moisturize that much better. Ceramides have a bunch of benefits. Like I said, check out that blog post for more information. When I'm done, I just clip all the hair to the top head so that it can all be reached by the steam. And here I'm just showing the amount of shed hair that I got. I think I haven't combed my hair um, and removed it in about two or three days, so that's not a lot of shed hair at all. I go into the steamer for about 15, 20 minutes, and then I shampoo it out. I'm using a sulfate free shampoo and you can see that I do not pile my hair on top of my head. I concentrate the shampoo at my scalp and then run it down through the length of my hair with my fingers. And I'm always sure to get the area behind my ears, my nape, those are two easily forgotten areas for caring for them. And again, I just run the sud down the length of my hair, concentrate it on the scalp and cleansing my scalp, and my hair gets clean as I run it down through. Here is the second wash. You can see that it's a lot sudsier, if that's the word. And again, I'm just running the suds and the shampoo and the lab down my strands. I am not agitating it and causing tangles by piling it to the top of my head. Now I deep condition with Carapro if you're interested in seeing my detailed deep conditioning, you can check out the Long Ace Handbook. Um, one of the exclusive videos is showing you how I deep condition. Um, you don't really get a good view here, but um, basically I just section off my hair, apply the deep conditioner from root to tip, and uh, use my finger. That's pretty much basic step. Once I get done applying all of the conditioner, again I clip the hair to the top of my head. You want to make sure you jet so that you can get um, you know, all of your ends and the length of your hair reaches the top where most of the steam and the heat uh, is concentrated. So clip all the hair up, go under the steamer for a few minutes. I rinse that out and then I take my Turby Twist towel and squeeze out the excess water. You can see that I'm not rubbing, I'm not um, you know, agitating my hair, I'm just gently squeezing it downward. To get the excess water out. After that, I always apply my leave-ins. Right now, I'm using James Carter Revitalizing Leave-In. It's a spray. Apply that all over my hair. I'm general. I mean, I'm generous with it. And then I use my Y2 comb. This is a magic rake comb from Hercules Sageman. I have a review on that in a video. Um, I just detangle. I'm only about three or four weeks post here so I don't have many tangles. And once I'm thoroughly detangled, I will um, go ahead and style. This week I decided to air dry. So I put a satin wrap around my edges and tied it tight. Uh, just to, you know, kind of lay down my edges there. 
and then I will air dry. If you're interested in seeing, you know, the finished result, what my air dry texture looks like, and how I styled it, you can check out the next video. The link will be coming up in a few minutes. So there you have my full wash day routine. I hope that you enjoyed it and that you found it helpful. If you have any questions, leave it down below. Otherwise, I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching. Take care. Stay blessed. Bye.